Hello, thank you for watching Wise Old Consumer. This is the Kinesis uh, ergonomic keyboard. In this video, I'll be uh, unboxing it. So, let's, okay. Instruction menu and the keyboard. So the great thing about this keyboard, obviously, that you is that you can have many configurations with the uh, standard keyboard. Um, space it out a bit so your uh, hands aren't twisted in or if you like to have it have a teeter and have your arms sort of in a more natural position so your wrists are not sort of locked You just want to attach the T, right? just push it in and it locks in place. So, and just press the button to release it. I find these keys on the connectors are very sensitive so just a light touch and it will register which makes uh, typing very easy. Uh, these extra keys uh, cut copy and paste I've basically rarely used I've just found it easier to go control C or control V however I found these uh, web keys that go back and take you home uh, quite handy the Kinesis is uh, plug and play so I have Windows 10 and basically as soon as I plugged it in it recognized and installed the correct driver for it um, so after using this Kinesis keyboard for a few days now I've decided that this is the setup that I like that's uh, slightly spaced apart but still sort of uh, flat like a traditional keyboard so I find when it's like this my arm alignment is still basically straight so I guess in a traditional keyboard my wrists will be bent slightly so that's the great thing about this Kinesis is that you can have many arrangements there's also uh, a palm pad attachment you can grab 
there's also a, an, a what is called the VIP2 attachment where you can actually get it to angle at various degrees so your wrist is actually more closer to being horizontal sorry closer to being vertical rather than being horizontal um, one thing I would say about this the kinesis is uh, the keys are there's not much feedback so I wouldn't recommend this keyboard to someone that likes uh, keys or s with feedback or with keys that require a significant amount of, of force um, for example mechanical keyboards have become very popular these days because you get basically feedback that you are pushing down 